and welcome back to another vlog. Today I am starting this vlog on a Friday, actually, which is a little bit different. I'm actually going to a yoga class this morning. I want to do more yoga and Pilates because I find I'm doing a lot of boot camp classes and I'm really bulking up, but I'll show you what I'm wearing to work out today. So this is my workout gear today. This is from Victoria's Secret. These are the TNA leggings, the thicker ones from Aritzia. I work out maybe five times a week and last time I worked out this much I was just losing and losing weight and this time I seem to be gaining weight and I know it's muscle because I'm not eating more than I used to. I'm not eating worse than I used to. So it is Saturday and we just went to the mall because I wanted to go talk to, first of all, I had, I posted on my Instagram, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you really should follow me because I post about new things that I get, like hauls, instead of like posting them all on YouTube because I just like will forget or I'll pick things up and I then, I don't want to make a whole video for it so I show it on my Instagram stories normally. So yesterday I was at Aritzia downtown shopping with my best friend and I found girlfriend denim jeans, the jeans that I were actually was actually planning on buying like ordering I was gonna order them from Revolve like two months ago but I decided against it because they are really expensive and yeah so they had them there originally for $400 marked down to $120 which I could not even believe my eyes they weren't even my size they were a size 27 I'm normally like a 25 and even though these really don't have a lot of stretch to them so I'm getting them taken in so that's why I had to go to the mall and another dress hemmed and then we're also planning our trip to Greece Ali, Mike, me and Paul and I are going to Greece on August 13th, around there. It's because my cousin is getting married on September 3rd in on a different island, so we said we'll just go make a vacation. Sorry. So we're planning that. And then I'm gonna miss the first few days of school, which I don't even really mind. And I'm gonna spend my birthday in Greece for the first time in my entire life. Normally it's always Ali who spends her birthday in Greece. Yeah, see you for a nice dinner. I got a question as to whether or not Paul is Greek and he's not Greek. He's actually just French Canadian. So this was my outfit today. Chanel espadrilles, these jeans from Zara, the shirt from Aritzia with my Louis Vuitton. I thought it was real cute. And Moishin, what our favorite restaurant. We got a salmon tartare, obviously enamored with sour. And he split it for us, which is so nice. But he's going to taste like caviar because I really don't like caviar. And I love caviar. This is a lobster roll. I don't normally eat lobster or like lobster, but Paul said we had to get it. I got a filet mignon. Look at that. The best potato. He got this huge thing. I have no idea. But we just finished dinner, and there's a... Africa festival here and we're in a little bit of a dilemma because we the only reservation they had was for like 6 30 and now we have nothing to do until later so we don't know what to do. Okay this is where the beer festival was. Montreal has some pretty places. Beautiful. I love our city. You always say how much you hate Montreal. The worst roads. Yeah. I don't know where we are to be honest. Somewhere downtown. Oh, is this like a shopping mall? Okay, so I'm leaving on vacation on August 11th or on August 10th and I'm gone until September 6th, which means I'm gone for my birthday, which is on August 29th. So Paul said that he'll buy me my birthday gift now. Um, and also because they had them at Chanel, uh, they will sell out really fast. So I saw them at the beginning of last week. So I thought this bag was really cute. It was like smaller than the regular bag that it comes in. This is the first time they've wrapped my espadrilles. I don't think they're ready. Whoa, they're fortunate. But you, you can't tell until they're on how nice they are. I guess I really wanted these because I've been obsessed with pearls recently, the aerial choker and all of that. And I think that the pearls look so nice in summer. Obviously, these are summer shoes. They have them in nude as well. Well, they didn't have my size today, but I was going for the black ones anyways because my black ones are completely worn out. Well, not completely. They still look pretty good, but they're really worn out. I've worn them so much. Like, basically every day for two summers I wore them. So I wanted another pair of black 
and they are really comfortable great everyday shoes my house is a pigsty but this is what they look like i'm in love with these how cute is that not with this face that's for show i was craving something sweet so i made chickpea brownies there's chickpeas maple syrup almond butter i put cocoa powder even though the uh, recipe doesn't call for it vanilla baking powder and baking soda i didn't have baking powder i only had baking soda so let's hope it works out i also think it might stick to the tin foil i put a little bit of peanut butter on top because i just love peanut butter and chocolate so much with some chocolate chips mixed in they're not the healthiest but they're definitely way better than regular brownies so right now i'm just cooking my meal i'm having these this is actually the first time i'm having this white yam mushrooms that are gluten free cholesterol free vegan there's no sugar and there is zero calories so this is what the package looks like they were in the same section as tofu noodles which i love they're a little bit different looking they look a little bit more like they're a little bit more see-through i'm just gonna boil them and i eat them with my dad's homemade pasta sauce which is my favorite i don't know i have a workout class at 7 15 tonight which i'm excited for and guys look at my muscle It's so baby, but I'm so proud of my little muscle. I finally have that like arm definition. I know it's very small, guys. I don't want like a huge muscle, but look at that arm definition. It's getting pretty strong over here. This top from Zara, which was like this. I love tying it recently. These are my favorite sweatpants. I'm probably gonna wear these on the plane, to be honest. These are so comfortable, guys. Oh, I was gonna sell them, but I decided not to. This is them cooking away. They look like regular noodles, kinda. I don't know, hopefully they're good. This is it, I just put it in the oven with some vegan cheese on top. It looks like real pasta. And then I also have a nice big Greek salad with lettuce. Got this vegan protein, which is my absolute favorite protein by Dr. Nicola. It tastes so good. I got more collagen peptides. I finished mine and I got tart cherry so i'm going to take I make a bulletproof coffee because i didn't have one this morning i'm going to take two tart cherries and i just ate a sandwich which i wish i waited for this but i already had a protein shake so today. this is my outfit today this camisole camisole what the hell i've never used that word in my life um this bodysuit is from arbitia i just got it i had this in black already but um, I lost it, so when I went back, they had a need one, so I got both, but I think at last time I got extra, extra small, this time I got extra small, and you can't exchange bodysuits at Aritzia. Stupid. So I have to go get this. I have to go back to the stitching store anyways, but I have to go get this, like, taken in, like, a little bit because it gets like loose here my hair is um beachy i did like a beachy look today these jeans are the girlfriend denim jeans the carolina i got them on sale for like 120 dollars and then i got them taken in at the waist i'm actually happy about that because they fit perfectly around the legs and perfectly around the waist now my espadrilles and then also this bag that's my look today I know this sounds really excessive, but I ate some like cake and stuff that I don't normally eat at my cousin's birthday. So I had to stop and get a little bottle of activated charcoal because A, I don't have any with me, and B, I lost my bottle somewhere. I've been losing everything recently, if you can't tell. And I got a huge bottle of water. So I take two because I'm going to another party, which I'm probably gonna have some alcohol at. So. With being said, I also got two protein bars to keep in my purse because sometimes I get hungry. I honestly just bought these because you can't use your debit card if it's under $10. So we're on our way to the P.O. Box in the States because I bought a bag. I said, I kind of gave you guys a little, well, I didn't give you guys a hint because I actually just posted a random picture I found, but I was like, I bought, I so told you guys I bought a new bag on Instagram and now I'm going to pick it up. I shipped it to the P.O. Box in the States. It's just like easier because it's coming from the States and like shipping to Canada, then I'm going to have to pay all kinds of duties. So I just did not want to deal with paying $200 in duties. And we need a hilltop, and you have a dress that was shipped yeah. there. Going to pass a little short day in the Not state. even. Like it's a like, few, like an hour, maybe two we're hours. We're going to go visit my godfather. Yeah. I'm going to do a little bit of an unboxing in the car because I have, <laughs> I have to unbox it in the car. Actually, if you follow on Instagram, I posted 
about this bag maybe two months ago, and then one of my followers, I hate saying that. I hate what, one of my followers? One of my followers. Okay, it's better than saying one of my fans. I hate when people say one of my fans. I know, but I don't want to say one of my followers. Like, one what? of my followers. Like, what Whoa. Of, someone, I don't know, one of you. I, I um, always say followers. Like, for me, our viewers, one of my viewers. So, one of you messaged me on Instagram and was like, Tony, did you see this? This is the bag that you wanted. It's on Fashion File. And I literally was walking through the mall with Ali after a workout one day. And I was like, oh my god. And I just literally stopped in the middle of the mall, bought this bag. It was such a good deal. Ali could not believe it. And I was actually, it was actually like meant to be because I was in the market for a new bag. I wasn't sure if I wanted the um, Gucci Dionysus bag. It's Dion Dionysus. Diana. Diana. I forget whatever that bag that everyone has but i would get that bag if it had a shorter strap and i know you can wrap it but i just girl you wanted one you were like yeah but like it. i didn't i wanted a mini bag because i've been obsessed with mini bags but i wanted like that like if i i knew that if i could ever get my hands on this bag i would buy it no matter what you know it's really bad because every day i wake up i'm like i'm not spending any money no, today it was a good deal it was a really good deal but every morning i wake up i'm like i'm not it actually at night mostly i'm like okay you literally did not need to buy that but you know when the, this is what i realized in the moment i really genuinely feel like i need i need it you know what I mean? Like, if I'm at Aritzia and I bought, like, a really cute new tank top that I need to, like, actually get taken in because I bought the wrong size, but you can't return it. <laughs> so, I was like, you need that. And then I go home, I'm like, I don't even have any room in my cupboard or my drawers, and so I'm gonna have to d give away, like, some clothes. You know, I just have way too much stuff. But I actually did want this, and, oh, the color is so pretty, and it's just... It was perfect for my vacation, so that's that. We're going. We also wanted to pick a halo top because now that Ali and I know our favorite flavors, we're just gonna get our favorite flavors and see if they have new ones. I personally, my favorite is vanilla. Like, how basic am I? Yeah, that no, my favorite really is good. vanilla. Like, it's the best. It tastes like literally Hagen Dazs vanilla. Our favorite thing. Like, if you watch Ali's video, what I eat in it was it in your what I eat in the day uh, that you showed yeah, it. That's like, me. we created this like banana. Thing. Like I don't know why I love the combination of cooked banana mm -hmm. and vanilla ice cream. It's just and cinnamon. It is so good. Okay, another thing I want to talk about that Ali reminded me is that I've been really into podcasts recently, but they also scared the shit out of yeah. me. Like I love the podcast. I've only ever listened to the podcast Insight. Ali told me to watch Unconcluded, but listen I haven't. To. Yeah, listen to Unconcluded. Like they're just so interesting. Although. A lot of them are about missing people, yeah. and I don't like when it's just like, so, was it this person or this person? I like when they're like, it was this person, he was arrested and charged, you know what I mean? It satisfies me when they're like, so, and then he was arrested and charged, and he's, like, I like that, but I always, like, now, am, like, when I'm home alone at night, I literally am terrified. <laughs> like, we all will, like, make a noise downstairs, so I'm like... And I like, I am so terrified and I cannot, like, if I'm home alone at night, I'm not showering. Like, there's no way. But you know, I've always been a scared person. Yeah. Like, I, at, when I was younger, I don't know, like, this sounds maybe like I'm schizophrenic, <laughs> but like, I was always paranoid. I always was scared that someone was like watching me, like, through my window. Or, like, you were like, scared of Michael Jackson. I was absolutely terrified of Michael Jackson. It's different because when you watch a scary movie, you can just be like, that was a movie. You know what I mean? Yeah. But, like, these are actual cases that you were like, what the hell? Like, this happened in real life? Holly and I are trying this kombucha. We're at a Price Choppers. I want another muffin, blueberry muffin thing. I don't think they have the one I like. But yeah, wild blueberry. No, that's not the right one. I don't think they have it. Oh my god, look, look, I want you to make this for me for my birthday. Coconut cupcake and frosting yeah. mix, do you want it? Yeah. We're waiting for my package to arrive and Ali made us go to Ali's bargain outlet. This town literally looks, I don't know if it's because it's a Monday, but it looks like a, it has been evacuated for a zombie apocalypse. I haven't been here in like seven years. If you told me there is a zombie apocalypse going on, I'd believe it. I believe it. It's, it's it's deserted, and this is not how I remember it. 
What was this? That is sad, you know? It's very it's sad. A, it's almost a dead mall. This used to have, this used to be like Taco Bell and really popular. What the heck? This is like my whole childhood just shattered. This is really, really sad. This used to be K Jewelers, I'm pretty sure. So what do they do now? There's just no mall. But this used to be like a really popular mall. Is there just no one here? It smells like it's real old. They had like a Victoria's Secret and they had, they, have a break? they had Old Navy at least. I remember that. So it said the package was delivered. So Ali went in to go and get it. Okay, so I got it here. I'm so excited. Oh, I'm so excited. So, the box is just a regular card. Oh my god, how adorable. So, like you open the box, it says fashion file. This is a nail file. It comes with, so this is what it looks like, and it comes with a little nail file, which is always good. I'm gonna leave that in my car. It says, thank you, we hope you love your purchase. And then I guess this is my receipt. <laughs> then it says, used is the new new. Comes in a fashion file. Oh, how cute is that? It's beautiful. It looks brand new. How adorable is that? Oh my Take god. Take out the tassels. What? Take out the tassels. It's okay. oh. I think. Oh no, this is the, the little pocket mirror. Oh, that is so cute. That's like, you got it for such a good price. There's a... Um, it comes with the... This. The crossbody strap. Yeah. Oh my god, it's like brand new. Like the hardware has no like So this is if you saw on Instagram I posted about this and then one of you guys told me What does the inside look like? Wow, like this person did not use it. It actually fits my makeup bag. I need to take this off, right? Yeah. Once you move this tag, this item is yours. I think I'm ready to I'm really happy because I wanted another bag. I was tired of always carrying the same bag, and this is like my dream bag. Yeah. I'm so happy. It's so okay. It goes with my shoes. So let's stick this in your. You don't want the fashion file bag, right? You, you can it's just, just a blunt I just got home, but I want to give this to Leo real fast. It's the Frosty Paws peanut butter ice cream. I want to taste it. Is that weird? I'm tasting dog food. Tastes like peanut butter. That's not sweet, but I think he'll like it. You don't get a full one, Leo. I'm sorry, you're too small. You want some Frosty Paws? Yeah, monkey. Oh, Leo, 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 calm, calm yourself. No, no. <laughs> Leo, lick it. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh my god, that's you're never getting that. <laughs> Allie's cousin, and I always do this. Like, Allie brings me somewhere, and I go <laughs> and I spend more than she does. I don't know how it happens. Really? Anywhere. I spent like $2,000 on this. Yeah, one. but you bought a computer. Anyways, I want to show the bracelet. How pretty is that? It's a little big on me because this is the standard size, and I have. Uh, but one. it was glistening in the sun. It was so pretty. And those, like, so I think people feel like they're too chunky, but they're not too chunky. No, they're at all. really, like, I love it. Like, if you just look at it like this. Yeah. It's really pretty. Okay. I'll see you later. Okay, so I went to Sunglass Hat to buy Ali a present. It's so hot, it's burning my skin. Oh my god. I went to um, Sunglass Hat to buy Ali's birthday present. She wanted a pair of sunglasses. And I, of course, because I'm crazy, bought a pair of my own sunglasses because, in my defense, I only have one pair of Lisbeck sunglasses, which I wear everywhere. So I was like, and I really wanted a pair of all black um, Dior's, which are like. 807 four, I don't know, like 600 or 800 dollars. So I got these. They, I fell in love with them when I saw them. They're like all black. They're polarized, which I had no idea what that meant. And they, I find they're so cute. Like I just wanted all black sunglasses, and I just think they're gonna be so cute for the feed. Now I swear I'm not buying anything else. Count how many times I said that in this video. Except right now I have to go buy supplies. But that, then I'm done. Then I'm done. Then I'm gonna go work. Shit. 
It's three o'clock. I forgot. I was thinking that we did our workout at nine in the morning. That uh, we, our workout was at twelve. So I was all I'm all confused. I was literally thinking that we did our workout at nine in the morning. Now I'm gonna be stuck in traffic. I have to get downtown and back before traffic starts. And I got my Aritzia top in. You know the top I wore. <laughs> It's so funny because when I'm like with Jana or like any of my best friends, I'm talking, I talk to them like I'm talking to you. So I'm, to I'm just talking to you, talking to my best friends here. You know the top I wore in Toronto to dinner, the one with the, like the beautiful top that was expensive from Aritzia, I was lace. Well, I've been losing everything recently. So I lost that top and it was like one of my all time favorite tops. I loved it and so I had to buy another one. If you're ever in Montreal, come to this orange julep. It is, they have the best hot dogs. They have Nathan's hot dogs are so good and the drink is so good and it's a huge orange. Like, come on, how cool is I wanted to talk about a few things before I left. I got my new shirt from Aritzia. It's not new, I've owned it before, but somehow I lost it. I wore my last vlog and then I never saw it again. Um, so yeah, I actually also toned my hair at home. Normally I get my hair toned like once every three weeks because my hair has like really blonde highlights under it and I like it to be like dark brown with light brown highlights. So I wanted to find something I could bring on vacation with me because God knows I am not going to be able to tone my hair for a full month while I'm in Greece. So I went to the store, I've heard about this before, and I got this John Frieda Brilliant Brunette Visibly Deeper Color Deepening Treatment. And honestly, this is something that I always would overlook at the drugstore, but it actually worked and I actually really like. I didn't leave it on for the full time because I was a little bit scared. Um, I didn't want it to like turn black because I don't want my black hair back, but this is just air dried hair and actually Guys, I've been loving this product. I got this at Sephora. Where is it? It's the IGK coconut oil gel I put this in damp hair and it actually smooths my hair out so much and then you can like give like texture to your hair this and then mix with the wave spray from way is so so nice i love how my hair looks natural now naturally my hair has this like texture until like i apply heat to it because it is damaged and i've dyed it and i use heat on it a lot but it just gives my hair such like a nice texture like i wouldn't mind wearing my hair natural i also got these i don't always like wearing a bra because i don't want my either the bra straps to show like on a top like this you don't want bra strap like you can it doesn't look bad but i just prefer not to have bra straps showing if it is like backless like I obviously don't want my bra showing so I used to try wearing nipple covers and I didn't like them because the ones I tried were very thick and then so when you you can see the outline in your shirt if it was like a tight shirt and I just was like stayed away from them but then because I'm going to Greece I needed something to cover my nipples and I have like you know like I just don't want to walk around with my nipples out like I just not down for that so I got these I ordered them on Amazon they came in two days I don't know maybe some people don't have have issues or don't care that their nipples are pointing out but not me girlfriend I don't want my nipples pointing out like the paper thin sticky of where the white part is excuse the bad fake tan but you can see how they're like just flush flush with it excuse the boob show but I just wanted to show you guys if you guys are looking for nipple covers I will list them down below because I personally hated seeing that but these like you can't see the outline of I mean obviously if you're wearing a see-through white shirt you're gonna see a nipple cover but who even wears that anyway I mean like I wouldn't wear that so I don't have to worry. Even if it's like a tight shirt, you won't see it. It really controls the nipple. Ali's birthday is this Friday if you didn't know and we designed a few new pieces like luxury pieces. I'll show you them in a second. One of them is this choker. I'm literally, I have not taken this off since I designed it but it's just this like mesh choker. You see how shiny it is? It has an extender so you can wear it higher or lower or like whatever size the neck you have it works and then obviously I'm wearing a matching bracelet I'll show you those right now so I obviously would not wear all of these bracelets at the same time but these are just some of the combinations that I have 
They are bangles and they are made to be a little bit looser. I do have really small wrists though, but they are made to be a little bit, little bit looser. You can squeeze them tighter. You can wear them like this or you can wear them or you can wear them on the inside of your wrist. These bracelets are really like they're really, really sparkly. You can't even really see how sparkly this is, but it sits flush on your skin and it's just a perfect bracelet. And then we have the snake bracelet right there. It's also available in gold, such a pretty gold color. I know I'm not going to be able to take this off in Greece. It's so pretty. Then we also designed like a lariat with a pearl and a few other pieces. So check back on Ellie's birthday. We're also going to be doing 22% off. So definitely I will leave a link down below. Follow me on Instagram because I always post about when we have our sales. I hope you guys enjoyed. Oh, another thing. You know how I got this bag? Um, which I'm so obsessed with. So this is where it comes and falls on me now, which I find is like a super cute length on me, exactly where I wanted. I actually went to like a shoemaker and he put more holes in this thing for me because it only went up to like there. And then I asked him to add three more holes and I'm so happy I did because if I want it longer for crossbody, I can. But it was just, I found way too long for me to just like have on that third hole because I'm really short and this is exactly where I wanted it. I can't believe like the good deal I got on this. I have to get to editing and then I have to get to working. So I hope you guys have a wonderful night and I will see you in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe and...